Guys, in this video, we're going to go over article sets. Um, article sets are basically a way to group your articles um, together so they're easier to organize. And it's very similar to what networks are for accounts is basically uh, what article sets are to articles. Um, so under the articles slash content tab, you'll find article sets. Um, you also see post sets. Article sets and post sets work exactly the same. It's just one is for organizing your articles. The other is for organizing your posts, but the format and everything of the pages are exactly the same. So let's just take a look here. When you load up the article sets page, uh, there you'll come across uh, a list of your article sets. And basically, it'll tell you how many articles are in each set. It'll give you the set name. You could quickly add a set, um, another set, and then it'll just quickly add you another article set. And then you'll have some options here to view your articles, edit, delete, um, delete the set and the articles, or delete just the set. What that means is if you delete set and articles, it's going to delete, permanent delete, permanently delete the articles and the article set from the system. So the articles won't be there anymore. But if you click just delete just set, it'll just delete the article set, but leave the articles um, to still be used later. Um, then we have our uh, bulk account. You could add sets to set. So if I wanted to add these six articles, to this set, I just uh, check that, or I could check multiple. And then if you click this, you choose, uh, I want to add it to the game set, and then it will add, I don't want to do that now, but if I did, I just click submit, and it would add all those articles to that set. So um, then this set would have 25 articles in it. Um, so it's just a quick way to move articles from set to set. Um, so now, if you want to go into a set, just click on the set, and here you'll see all your articles laid out similarly to the ad or the regular articles page. Uh, you'll see the name, title, content, you could do things like preview, you could download the article, you could edit the article, delete the article, etc. So you could do all that from this page. Um, you could also delete, bulk delete, it says accounts there, it should say articles. You could delete all these articles permanently and whatnot. And uh, we're getting in a feature where you could permanently, or you could remove them from the set um, in bulk as well. So that should be in there in the next few days. Um, so then if you wanted to add articles to the set, you just click the add articles to set button. And uh, your articles will pop up. And the ones that are checked are already in your set, so you can uh, you could add other articles. Uh, if I wanted to add that in, I just click that and then choose, and then I have uh, that article will now be added to the set. There we go. And then if I wanted to remove articles from the set, I could just uh, say I wanted to remove this long title article, just on check it there and see now it's been removed from the set. So this is a basically easy way to organize your articles. You could do searches, you could search by other sets. Um, so you can load up a different article set and see the articles that are in that set. And uh, so th it's just all very easy way to organize your articles into a more manageable um, set up for when you go to add projects. That way you can just have them all in one set, choose the entire set if you want to, or if you have a lot of categories, say you had a ton of car insurance articles, you can make a car insurance article set. When you go to add categories, just load up that car insurance set and either select all or select the articles within that set. It just makes uh, organizing your articles very easy. And there's really not that much more to it. It's very similar to the networks uh, page for accounts. Um, uh, and that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next video.